Hello everyone, it is Friday. Why am I only just starting a vlog on Friday? I hear you ask. I've not been very well, I've been a bit sick this week, so. <laughs> However, my very first scenes arrived earlier this week. I'm so pleased with how they've turned out. I'm honestly over the moon with them. They're really cute and pretty. Very, very pastel. I love them so much. These are very limited. There's only 50 available. They're going to be going into the shop tonight at 8 o'clock uh, UK time. They're numbered 1 to 50 as well. So if you do manage to grab one, let me know which number you got. They're also signed and dated in the back. But these are going live tonight. And I'm really, really happy with them. It's inspired me to create a few more zines in the future and maybe even some like mini comics or something. That would be really cool. Um, I'm so pleased with them. So that is something exciting that's happened this week. I've also been painting with the gouache again and I've been doing these love birds. They're about finished, I think. I'm not sure. I want to go back to them later today and just see if there's anything else that I want to add to them. But I'm really pleased with how I seem to be managing to get to grips with gouache. The first time I used them I was like I shouldn't be using these like acrylic but if that's what you're used to I guess it's hard to snap out of it but I'm getting there and I think I've got the hang of it and starting to um, feel for how it works. Anyway it's post run time and I'm going to go and check my PO box as well. Then when I get back I really need to take some pictures of these ready for the launch tonight and also take some pictures of some badges because I've changed the branding slightly and I just want to update the shop a little bit so a bit of admin. I think it's time for a bit of small business love as well. How cute is this jumper? I ordered it from Sugar and Sloth in the middle of a heat wave, but I saw it and I've had my eye on it for a while actually and I thought oh I think I'll just treat myself but it is so cute and really really soft on the inside Ooh. and also this lovely llama pin look at this mystic llama box and amongst the goodies in there there was this little parcel from Georgia who runs uh, the Dew Drop. It's so pretty. The little ghost sticker. How adorable. And oh, look at this adorable pin which reminds me um, I need to update my pin display and pop a couple more on. Um, there's these lovely cactus and succulent stickers. They're very very sweet. And these adorable button badges which will be going on my flag up there as well so thank you so much georgia you really didn't have to send me all of these but they are so cute hello everyone it's now a fresh new week it's monday again i had to stop vlogging last week because i got a kidney infection <laughs> Uh, I ended up needing to go to hospital late on Friday night. I've never had a kidney infection before, but thank goodness it's clearing up. I'm feeling much better now that I've had some antibiotics. So now I'm just off to the post office. It's a fresh new week, so let's see what we can get up to. The zines have nearly gone. <laughs> There's uh, 16 left as of this morning. So thank you so much if you've grabbed one. I didn't expect them to sell this well. So thank you so much. I'm taking all of your orders to the post office now. They're going to love me this morning. <laughs> and then when I get back, I want to do the grash bird painting that I've scanned in and take that into Procreate just to tidy up a bit and see if I can um, just make it a bit neater. Because you know when you scan a traditional piece in, you're always like, ooh. So I just want to take it into Procreate and see if I can just work some magic with it. But first, let's get all of these parcels to the post office.
most adorable order come through from Lily in space and look at how pretty her writing is. Um, if I could write like this, I could die happy. Look how adorable this pin is. My pin collection is slowly but surely growing. Isn't it cute? And this is her business card. This is where you can find her. This badger print. <laughs> this one's my favourite. He's so pretty. This one's my favourite. He's awesome. He's so cute. And then these bird ones. Which are really cool too. Look at the pastel colours. I love how Lily draws birds. Oh, they're so, so sweet. So this month, my diary ran out. <laughs> Wait, runs out in a couple of weeks. So I've had to go and get a new one. How cute is this one from Sainsbury's? It's really chunky though. Uh, luckily, I don't take it away from the house or anything. <laughs> if you're anything like me, you do not feel like your life is together. Which, it definitely isn't anyway. But I don't feel organised in the slightest if I don't have a diary. <laughs> This week I have been having a big clear out of stuff, so all of this craft stuff is stuff that I haven't used in years and I'm going to donate it to a local primary school so they can get crafty and things at Christmas or you know whatever with their activities and things. There's pom poms in there and all sorts of you know old pencils and things that I thought school might be able to get a bit of use out of. So I've just restocked the British Bird sticker packs after having a fallout with this knob. And these just arrived. These are my new prints of the Lovebirds. And I thought it'd be really cool to show you guys the process from painting to finished print. I um, I tidied it up ever so slightly in Procreate on my iPad. And then took it back into Photoshop to set the artwork file up. But I'm really pleased with how it's turned out. And I went for like a lovely textured paper can you see that oh it's lovely so it still kind of looks like a painting i'm really pleased with these and i'll add them to the shop tomorrow hello so it's now friday again i feel a bit like i've been all over the place this week because i'm recovering still I'm feeling a bit fragile but i wanted to finish this piece today i started it a few weeks ago um and it's still not done <laughs> So I thought I'd finish it today and then make some stickers to put as freebies into my shop orders. So let's get this done. Um, and I thought I would give this a go. The last stars on Netflix. I love a bit of history. I love it, especially the Romanovs. So um, yeah, let me know if you've watched it already.